just to be a turd. Oh, well, everybody's heard about the bird. Alright, we are now live. Welcome to our live stream. There's nobody Tyler to watch. Will be the There's nobody listening. But player cool. unknown battlegrounds. And I will be providing lively commentary while playing Black Ops 3 for about 45 seconds. Why are you only Why playing it for 45 seconds, man? Because I will inevitably get bored or frustrated. I think frustrated is more likely. Do something stupid. Going to New York this weekend. Tomorrow into Saturday. Nice. You're not going to that concert, correct? Oh, I want to, but no. Um, going to go to Central Park, that uh, history museum that's near Central Park. Um, not the art museum. Gonna walk around Times Square, go to the fancy stores. Let's see what else. Uh, go to a wax museum. Nice Never museum been Central Park. Yes, never been to a wax museum, so I'm gonna go to that. I think it's gonna be creepy. Might also smell in there, I imagine. Um, gonna go to this cheesecake place, where their whole bakery is nut free, which is good, and the cheesecake is thirty dollars for a whole for cheesecake. It's two pounds, mind you. Uh, You're breaking up a bit. Yeah, because I'm at that part. Yo, so gonna go to this cheesecake place where the cheesecake is twenty nine yep. fifty, but you get two pounds of it. So that's pretty solid. Um, might go to Coney Island if there's time. Pounds of cream cheese? Do you think is in that? What type of cream cheese? I don't know. I can ask them. That's how I. It's been voted the Zagat number one cheesecake in the world or something. They said some crap on their website. What I normally do is I put, I put my cheesecake uh, in between a bagel. It's <laughs> just cream cheese, actually. But believe you me, it goes in between that bagel real nice. You've never seen cheesecake slide into a bagel the way my cheesecake slides into a bagel. We're also gonna die really quickly because I landed in a spot yeah, that's dangerous. Got a uh, $220 hotel. Got a $220 hotel for free because frequently nice. stay at hotels in my travels, yeah. I actually have enough points to get a that this hotel for two more nights for free, but I'm not. I have a tournament in New Hampshire on Sunday. Ed Sheeran tickets are like three hundred dollars. I'm not interested that in is Ed a Sheeran lot. tickets, but I it came up on my. Uh, might have been SeatGeek app. Yeah. Or something as a concert coming up in New York, I, and it was that, that much money. Too. What? And then it came up on SeatGeek, which was helpful. I think I knew that Arcade Fire was playing here in DC, but then it came up on SeatGeek, and that was that, that solidified it towards for you. Exactly. Oh, P.S. Our stream today. I've changed our stream that our channel is for everyone, not for just mature audiences. So, you know, minimal swearing. Some swearing is fine, but not so much that people could complain saying this ain't for children. Then again, by the games we're playing, they might be able to decide this probably is not for kids. But not super 
you know, probes. We're not the MPAA. Exactly. Alright, that game was is over, so now I'm playing another game. Another this what do you mean? Safeguard. Yeah. In the same lobby, but it's gonna be a full game, so that hopefully will go better. Killed one, was killed by one. Got killed from far away. Yeah, but I heard you finished first last game. Yep. We have one viewer, you know who it is? Me, on my Chromebook. So I can monitor the nice. chat, so when people come in here, I can chat. Snip sniped me. Rude. So is that a thing that's catching on? Just saying the word rude. You've been doing it. When my cousin was here, she was doing it. My lady friend does it. Quite a bit, because I'm frequently rude. But that's neither here nor there. I don't know. I think that's just constantly been... Been, I think. Just saying rude. No, just going rude. I guess that is. I never really thought about it that much. By the way, I now can recommend Eastbound and Down. I have not finished it yet, but I think the character of Stevie makes it completely worthwhile. He's just doesn't Will Ferrell have a hilarious part in that? Like a not a main role at all. Yeah, he's like... pretty funny, but. This guy, Stevie, is pretty amazing, some of the stuff he does. He's just so stupidly great. You also feel bad for him, but so what? You know what it feels like, because people often feel bad for us. But now... We're laughing at them. I don't now know why we're we are. Now we're on damn it, teammates. Kill somebody. Uh, I guess one teammate killed 17 people. The rest of us combined killed 19. So, he was helping out. How many did you kill? I killed four. How many robots did you kill? A single robot. How many brobots? Infinite brobots. Um, no one else has killed any robots. Oh, there you go. So you're the best player on the team by far. No ifs, ands, or buts. Oh! Got a buffalo chicken salad today. I was pretty excited for it. But when I got here, buffalo the buffalo chicken, chicken came in a separate container than the salad, so I had to mix it myself. Less oh, excited than that. Salad. Not like chicken salad. No, no, no. A salad with buffalo okay. chicken in it. Not, okay. uh, not chicken salad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it, it wasn't that mixed makes in. That sense, but I was just not thinking like that. I was upset that I had to mix it in. No, that you shouldn't have to be. But maybe that kept it from... I don't know. The... I only took like two bites because I also got mozzarella sticks and I wasn't that hungry. And I wanted the mozzarella sticks more. So it's in the fridge now. Probably to not be eaten by me. But yeah. Someone will eat it, maybe. Alright, the enemy team is just wrecking us now. Now we are on off. 
Like we didn't do great, but we didn't do terribly on defense. And now we are getting completely and utterly destroyed on offense. Side note, there's no nudity allowed on Twitch. I think we've been over this. Well, I don't have the camera on, so. I was reminding myself. That wasn't as much for you as it was for me. I'm gonna change into a. I'm gonna get out of the BRM and change into the Weeble. <laughs> so I can be quicker. The what? The Weeble. That's W, right? E E V I L, I think. I think there might be two E's. I said E E V I L. But I didn't really enunciate. He didn't. You loser. There's a lot of fighting going on. Not near me. Well, kind of near me. But I don't have any guns to, you know, fight back. <laughs> so, we're going to let them get one of those. Yeah, I tried looking, but then there was danger everywhere I went, so I decided to just run away. Hmm. There's a person on fire or a car on fire or something. I don't know. I just need to worry about getting in the circle. And the nerf that is perp. Running past all these unlooted houses that we can't loot because we're so far behind. A car would be nice. Motor vehiculars. Ooh, is that a car? We might have found one. Nope. Nice. It's not. Oof, oof. So close. Rusted old dingus. Mm. We might die in the first circle. For not getting to the circle. Which would be a shame. Would it? It would be pretty embarrassing. Ah oh, man, I've fallen down the leaderboards. I was second for most of the game. Need to do some more stuff. See something on fire, and it's moving. I don't know if it's a person or what. It's a motorcycle. How'd it get on fire? How does anything get on fire? Uh, God damn saying. it. Damn it. I almost get stuff. Ah, shouldn't swear. Shouldn't swear. Shouldn't swear. Thanks for repeating it three times that you shouldn't swear. <laughs> Actually, we should get into the circle. We're not going to die from being outside the circle. We might get killed by other things, but not from being outside you the circle. You still not have a gun? That's right. Sorry, I have a pistol and a crossbow, so not really a gun. Are you playing anybody in fantasy football at the moment? I'm playing Wookiee of the Year. Ooh, Poss possibly no the person you just traded Cops. with. What? Oh, I didn't no play him. I didn't play him. Well, so. good, because he doesn't have any catches. Figured when you said no catches for Cooper Cup. Yeah, gotta keep running. I don't even have healings. Gross. Gurley has two touchdowns. I saw that. When I checked, he had 15 yards. But two, two titties. 
Racking careful, up. careful. That Racking almost sounded like a titties. bad word. Mm, you can't. We are a family-friendly show now. No titties. Can't even say it. Now, I know you can't show them. Can't even say it. another motorcycle on fire. What's going on with these motorcycles where they're all on fire? Must be feeling hot, hot, hot. There's a car that's flipped over. Uh, room when Michael plays that there, he's sad. Hopefully there's nobody in this compound. We need weapons. We need healing. And a backpack. And healing. No weapons, though. Oh, you asked me if I'd do a two for one. I would do a two. I would potentially do a two for one for you. Name it. Uh, Drew Brees and Tom Brady. Okay. For what? Tyree Kill. <laughs> not bad. Not bad. I can live with it. I'm guessing it would be a combination of your bench players, and I'm not interested in any of them. It could be starters. I don't care. Do you find that any of them... Do you feel any of them have a pretty mouth? You can take that one. Not going to expand upon that for the sake of the family friendly show. But you know what I mean. Oh, my eyeball. Oh, that's a nice hit right there. Oh, crap, someone's shooting. It's all your fault. Not very accurately, though. Gosh damn it. Oh, there he is. There's someone. Creeper. Now we're dead. Top 30, though. Mm. Nice. Yeah. Well, considering we only have a pistol, I guess. I do really love Jimmy Graham's stat line from last week. Yeah. One reception, one yard. Is that better or worse than Zeke's, though? Nine rushes for eight worse. yards. Is it? I don't he know. He caught, like, ten yards worth of passes. Oh, he did? Yeah. Okay, fair enough. As long as he didn't just get point eight points. Um... Yeah. I do like most of your players. Thanks, man. We had a lot of similar targets. Your bench guys, I don't... are all okay, but they're not... You don't want Frank Gore? I feel like the quality of players that I would trade to you are of mostly higher quality than the players you would trade I'm to I'm mainly you. just interested in Reek. My quarterback situation is better than yours. Not that Mario is bad. He's actually good for fantasy. Fantasy. You were breaking up. My quarterback situation is better than yours, though. That is definitely true. I've got two legends of the game. Two titans of industry. You have Marcus Mariota. Very good player, though. Yeah. Especially for fantasy. I remember I had Peyton Manning the year when his first year at Denver, where his first game he had yeah. like 50 plus points. That felt good.
I've switched to Fracture. And so far I've killed two people. Ah! I got killed while depositing four files. Would you ever donate semen? Don't ignore me. I didn't hear you. Would you, you ever breaking up? Yeah, I bet you like that pervert. Would you ever donate the semen? No. Really? What? Okay. What if the the rates for that went up? I don't know how much they pay now. I imagine not much. What if it's like a thousand bucks per donation? I still don't think so. Keep in mind, hold on. Just... Keep in mind, per donation does not mean for every individual sperm. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for snorting. Thank you for clarifying that. <laughs> <laughs> well, I felt you would have asked a dumb question to be funny, like, does this mean every sperm? So I had to say no. Well, what other que what other dumb question to be funny would have would that answer have sufficed for? <laughs> I think that's the only. I don't know. We are. We can come up with some dumb ones, I'm sure. We are very stupid. Hey, don't you dare say that. After the semester, my advisor said I will have two, count them, two associate's degrees. Nice! Because <laughs> I have so many credits. But in all seriousness, I should be uh, about 70% done with my bachelor's. <laughs> all from a my, middle, uh, a community college. One, a uh, former co-worker of mine said he went to college back a while ago. Um, not an insane amount of time, but like 20 years ago probably. Maybe a little bit longer. That's pretty um, insane. He said that he was planning, I forget what he ended up getting, but he was he like switched majors like a couple times and he had so many credits that just one year he was planning on he thought he was gonna have to take like another semester worth of classes and they just told him no graduate with a like neural degree like <laughs> a liberal you're graduating with a liberal arts degree. Get out of our <laughs> they, school. Exactly. Hey, if I was a school, I would let the kid do whatever they want, because I'm just going to keep getting money. Well, that's the Southern Connecticut State University philosophy. Right. Like, I'll tell you what classes to take, but if you don't take it, I don't care. Well, they didn't even really care about that part. I don't like advisors, because I try to tell you Why what not? to take. It's like, hmm, I can just look at what classes are needed to graduate and then take those on my own. I don't need you to advise me. But I'm sure they serve a good role for a lot of people. I think it's more of a laziness thing. I don't like having to travel to their office and uh, talk to them to tell me stuff I could figure out on my own. Uh, lightning strike? Sure. Hey, you're a politics guy. Have you ever heard of a someone involved in politics in Connecticut named Lisa Moody? She's one of my professors. Adam Kokesh? Okay. She's one of my professors, <laughs> and another professor said, Oh, you guys don't even know. Back in the day, she'd be in the Hartford Current for her work in the government all the time. Good stuff, bad stuff, anything. And I don't know who she is. And I The name might be really familiar care. or it might be She's the one who got excited class. over the uh she's the one that got excited over the smarties she found in her pocket. And boy did she get excited. Oh, okay, I know something we're going to do when you come here. This is a little insight for anyone that's watching, which is no one, but it's still a little insight of what's coming. We're going to purchase for $5 the game 
comedy night where people create their avatars and then they perform stand-up comedy in front of an audience of just people watching and we will do that and it will go horribly it will record that that will not be live streamed that will be recorded possibly multiple sets of comedy so we can release that in multiple episodes it's gonna be horrible Uh. That sounds like a mistake. It sounds like something we would do. Poorly, but we would do. I gotta figure out the time. The timing. Well, I'm available literally all day. Yeah. I'm just guessing my family would like to see me a little bit. So, so come all night. Out how to, that. Just come that's, at night time. That's what I'm... You wanna do set, full set for Saturday night, though? I don't know what date that is, but sure... The 6th, right, it would be? Or the 7th? The 7th, I think. Yeah, 7th. Yeah, that's fine. We could do two sessions if you wanted. Friday night and then Saturday night. That way you're home during the day. All day or day. All day or day. And then we do our thing. Chicken wang. We chicken wing it up. We chicken wang it up. Alright. Gonna loot one no. more house this time. Chicken wings. No sauce. <laughs> oh, remember that? I mean, I'm yes. assuming you do because you just brought it up. Where you ordered. Do you remember the antidote? The, the story that you brought up that I have not brought up. Do you remember that thing that you just said? Well, do you? <laughs> I do. Where you picked up. Oh, well, why don't you tell it for the viewers at home? Ooh, that is. We went to a diner, and I ordered some chicken wings. I stupidly assumed that the chicken wings would uh, be coated in buffalo sauce, because I think, actually, no, it wasn't chicken wings, it was buffalo wings. It was buffalo wings, which made it worse. Ordered, yes. ordered buffalo wings, and they came... In the nude. It was pretty gross looking. It looked... And then uh, I had to ask for buffalo sauce. <laughs> and they gave you a, a decent sized container of the buff. It wasn't bad buffalo sauce. Well, maybe that's why they didn't want to give it to you originally. is because they know it's good stuff, so they were hoarding it for themselves. They want to keep this secret. Like, uh, like one time I went to Hot Topic, not my place that I normally shop at, but I was there with someone. What and... are you talking about? That's that's your scene, man. <laughs> and this lady... You're a hot topic connoisseur. The employee, the manager, I later found out. I asked her what her favorite thing in the store is, because I don't know anything in the store. And she lost her mind about this skirt. It was a black skirt made of denim, black denim, blenum Ooh. skirt that... Had buttons in the front, snap buttons like basketball pants where you can just rip them off in the front. And she said that's her favorite item. And she put who, her and her coworker put two on hold, and they're gonna buy it right after their shift. Now, I don't know her, so I can't really judge her character. But if I learn someone is wearing a skirt. That has snap buttons that are in the front of the skirt. No, 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 no. I imagine they no, have, good, ta- have good times. Not. That's, I'm, that's all I'm leaving it at. That's all I'm leaving it no. at, is that they have good times. They're fun time Charlies. Her, eye, her eyes got real big and her mouth ran a mile a minute talking about this skirt as a guy I was much less impressed because I can't wear it she suggested I wear it as a top and I said no which I think was the correct choice sure why couldn't I wear it as a bottom 
I feel like I would be more likely to wear it as a bottom. I mean, I wasn't. I wouldn't wear it at all, but as a bottom than as a shirt. There's no armholes. I'm not going to create my own armholes. I don't have the scissors nor the steady hand for that. All right, you want me to read you a Facebook post that I stumbled across? Facebook post? Sure. Facebook. Y'all kill me with all this praise for Chipotle as good as Taco okay, Bell. Okay, I saw it, but read it. It's Taco Bell been to you. Back when you was dead broke, where was Chipotle? You don't abandon you folks. That's <laughs> been down from day one. You got a little money now, so you too good for a cheesy gordita crunch. You gotta drop at least twelve dollars to eat good at Chipotle. But Taco Bell used to fill you up for three dollars and seventy five cents and you got a Baja Blast Mount <laughs> too. A lot of y'all forgot where you came from and it's sad. It's Not sad. me though. Chicken chalupas till I die. Hashtag fire sauce Taco Bell. I don't like Chipotle. I had it once. I found it to be too bland. Whereas you go to Moe's Southwest Grill and you get their queso, makes everything I'm, nice and moist and nice flavoring. Well, Chipotle has queso now too. Now, at least when I went, yeah. they didn't. I got the. When leaves. did you go? Did you go within the last like month or two? No. So well, when I went, it in the last, like, month I got or two. leaves, rice, beans, leaves. Some- some real dried out chicken. <laughs> well, that was your first mistake getting chicken. <laughs> All of it looked dried out, so I don't see how it would make a difference. I usually get the steak, but the most recent time I got uh, pork. Yeah, they gave me a whole bed of leaves. It was a rough time. For that, you get a taco salad at Taco Bell if you want a salad. And then you get the the uh, tortilla bowl that comes with it. Tortilla shell. Make some mighty fine business. You also get some sour cream Ooh. and some salsa on top of the stuff. Maybe some guac. <laughs> you get beef, rice, shredded lettuce. Tomatoes, I usually take off the I got the a taco yesterday. Yeah, you told me, but it wasn't at the Bell. It was not, but it was good. Mm, would have been better at the Bell, and probably significantly cheaper. But I have a feeling cheaper, you got yes. this for free. Better, no. I didn't get this for free. What do you mean, no? It would have absolutely been better. You don't know that. You don't know my life. Oh man, the fracture moved on me. That's just rude. What is fracture again? You pick up essentially dog tags. Yeah, but okay. if the people get killed, you can hold like 10 dog tags. You have to bring them to the drop point. And if people get killed, they spew their dog tags that they were carrying. Just ah! We died. Yes, we did. <laughs> fact check true. I don't like people that say true facts. True fact, yeah, no. What do you like? If someone like says that, you have true? to you have to be called out because a fact has to be true, or else it's not a fact. So you're okay with fact check and true. Correct. Sure, yeah, I'm fine with that. Because that means you are checking to see if the fact is true or not. If it is in fact a fact, and then if it's true, true. I think that's reasonable. Also, completely unrelated, but kind of related. I'm not a fan of... Hollywood trying to push Charlie Hunnam, I believe that's his name, as a leading actor. He's a... He 
He's a star. Because he was from Sons of Anarchy. Yeah. Then they tried to push him in Pacific Rim, and he was quite unmemorable. Then, uh, that King Arthur. Yep, star of King Arthur. There's probably some other stuff, but they keep putting him in leading roles where there's nothing about him to me that shouts leading role. He does not have the ability. Maybe he does. But from what I've seen, I'm, I've not enjoyed him. What do you miss? What is he missing for you? The charisma factor? He seems pretty bland. I haven't seen him been funny. That doesn't mean he can't be. I think he might make a good action person. So he's got a solid physique. And he, I think he's considered good looking. So maybe a romantic comedy lead. But they're trying to push him. I don't know. I don't... He's no Matthew McConaughey. Yeah, the thing is, he's... He's overqualified. Like, they're handing him these roles. And I think he's, he is probably a little overqualified for the action business. I mean, I've never seen Sons of Anarchy. I'm sure he was great in it. But, like, these other roles I've seen him in, I've not been impressed. There's probably some indie movies or something that I haven't we haven't seen that he's in that he does well. He must be doing something well to keep getting these roles. Like Pacific Rim, leading role, that's a huge movie. King Arthur was trying to be a huge movie, wasn't. Is he going to be in Pacific Rim too? I don't know. The most Pacific of Rims? Is, is it, what is the title of Pacific Rim 2? I don't know. Do you see the new concept for what they're going to make Hellboy in the new Hellboy movie? Reboot, I guess it would be. It's really funny. The reason I say it's really funny is it's identical, pretty much, to what Hellboy was in the original Hellboy movies. So it's nice. Not, it, like, there's, on quick glance, I didn't look at it for a long, t like, for a period of time, but at quick glance, it was identical. I did not even know they were doing more Hellboy movies. I'm pretty unhappy, because I thought What's-His-Name was good in it. Ron Perlman? Yes. And then this is He's not old, Ron though. Perlman. So what? It's just his voice, really. No, he's still definitely acting in it. Did I get him? Sorry. Ah, oh, no, I injured him. I, we died. Um, yeah, but, I mean, like, it doesn't need to be him acting it. Like, the stunt stuff. I also, well, I just don't know why it looks like he's Oh! Mmm! You know it looks whole really, really bad. The new Tomb Raider movie trailer that just came out. Uh, I haven't seen it yet. Oh, you should watch it. When I saw I it, the first thing I thought was like one of those cheesy sci-fi movies that are low budget. I but it has your it has the lady eyes. you like in it, uh, like Alicia Vikander or whatever her name is. I don't like Alicia. I'm pretty sure you've mentioned her. I've mentioned her, but I don't. I think I've ever seen anything with her in it. Okay. I just know... I, I know at some point you've mentioned her. Yeah, no, because she got real big when... For uh, Ex Machina. Ex Machina. Because then she was on something else, too. Ex Machina oh, 2. Looks, oh, that is... That is terrifying. What? Isle of Dogs? What are you talking about? Look on oh, movie. yeah, yeah, yeah. Wes Anderson's oh new movie. God. I haven't seen it. I haven't watched the trailer. That... Oh, you don't need to watch the trailer. Just look at the picture? Yes. Oh, I saw the picture. I, that's why I didn't watch the trailer. I, I felt it was not necessary. Alright, Tomb Raider trailer. Ooh. Ooh. That's a dog. 
What? You some for written content. We could do some either film reviews or wait for this trailer reviews. I'm down for trailer reviews, not film yeah. reviews. I watch a lot of trailers. I know. I I know. Not and not many films. How's that trailer going? I'm. S I paused it to make that point. Now. <laughs> Good thing you paused it. Wouldn't want you missing any part of it. camera shots that they're choosing with the father talking to her are horrendous. Yeah, then this is the trailer where they're trying to sell the movie. Where they've had however long to come up with this stuff. Looking at the video camera, I promise. Not even plugged into the television. What's up, man? That jump off the ship. It was a big budget film. Actually, I don't know the budget. I like Walton Goggins. I'll just assume that's a person and take your word for it. It is. It looks like he's the head bad guy. The head cheese. Big cheese. You like the way he displays that cheese? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Where's my computer? So how was it? It was interesting. Are you more excited for the movie now or less? Uh, equally excited. Considering you did not know it existed beforehand. <laughs> I knew it I knew it existed, but I had forgotten. Me too. I found my computer. I remember when they first announced that she was in it. And I just thought to myself, oh, that's a real person. That's cool. And then well, I saw that. It doesn't look like they've gotten really anyone else of note in the movie. Like, I Walton said, Goggins is not a huge draw. How dare you say that? It's a national treasure. I assume it's a huge You know what he is in, though, right? No. He's uh, in Vice Principal. Right. So, oh, that's back. Did you watch it? Is it back yet? Uh, no. I don't know if it's back yet. I know it's. I would imagine it's back because they've been hyping running it, promos for it. Yeah. Is it better than The Office? Of course. Oh. Anything's better than The Office. <laughs> that is a very off-brand uh, take for us. You. Yeah. What are you playing now, Ming? Nothing. I'm going to look at the, the website. 
Yeah, see if there's anything to change. The online game journal wording underneath the logo needs to change. Okay. I don't know what it needs to change to, whether it's bigger or just completely absent. I don't know. But it looks a little ridiculous. The wording right underneath the logo on the website is a little silly. Especially since we have the other logo underneath it. Yeah, we could probably get rid of it if we wanted. Yeah, I I think so. Can you uh, look up? <laughs> well, first, not even look up. Have you seen Alfonso Soriano recently? Yeah. <laughs> and you didn't bring this up to me? This guy's a uh, monster. He has a lot of muscles. For no need. Well, we don't know what he does in his free time. But, like, my guess is he always wanted to be huge, but it just wasn't conducive to him as a baseball player. So he never yeah. was. So now he's taking it to the extreme to make up for lost time. Or that's just how big he's always wanted to be, which is quite large. How old is he? Oh, I guess we don't know exactly how old he is. That was a controversy when he was playing. Was it? Yeah. I forgot what team, but... There was some teams that didn't want to take him or some sign him to a long contract because they weren't a hundred percent certain with how old he was. I just killed someone. Nice. I wasn't even playing the game. Well, it's got a lot of crap, but like no good guns. Sorry. Better luck next time, muchacho. That's what happens when you play the game. You try to sperm the worm and you get got. I don't know what that means. Bottom line is, he tried to sperm the worm. <laughs> that poor man. Some reason I feel bad a lot of times when we kill when we kill weaker people than us, which doesn't happen often, but occasionally. Like, right when a game starts, getting a gun first and then killing someone near you, I feel bad. Did this guy really not find a gun in here? If I saw, yeah, I saw him today on an old episode of Sports Real Nation. Real Mature. Not Sports Nation. Was it Sports Nation? I don't know. And he was obscenely large. It was kind of gross. Trying to figure out where to edit what you said. What I said? The online game journal part. Oh. How to edit that. I can tell you. But I have to think about it. Alright, you want me to tell you? I'll tell you to the best of my knowledge. Okay. Hit me. So you're on where the... Crap, there's a guy nearby. On the side. Yep. Where you like you can change stuff, right? Yeah. Okay. Go to themes and hit customize next to the themes. Okay. There should give you options of like changing pictures on the website and some other stuff. One of those I think should be the words. It might be title or something. Yep. I'm not sure. I what. I see. It. There's just something. I don't remember what title. it is. Yeah.
We need some mo. To think we'd be waiting a month. To get something we may or may not like. Five different designs, though. So we'll probably like one of them. Waiting a month. And $150 spent. Where we were able to get something we are pretty happy with. I mean, we can request for revisions if we want. But yeah. that we're pretty happy with for a total of $15. It's pretty good. It is. Um... And we were able to get it immediately. What happened? Because I heard you swear. No, I just said, um. No, before that. Or what's the um for, I guess? Uh, I'm just trying to do this. Oh. This, I'm trying to figure happened. out if I was going to do the trailer part, how to how to do it. So I'm just kind of playing around a little bit with this. I have no clue what you're talking about, so okay. Um, if we're going to do, if we will do written trailer reviews. Oh, I have a whole outline for reviews for like how we can do it that I have to send to you to see if you agree or disagree. Okay. Where it's pretty much a question and answer type of thing. Not quite, like, we have an outline that are questions you have to answer. And then when you answer them, you have, like, the full review. Got it. It's in my head. I have not written it, but it's been in my head for a while. Like how I don't get to save this and not publish it. What? That part, it wouldn't let me just say the ad, the movie. I figured out how to just by playing around so I want to see how to save it but not publish it and I don't know if it let me. well how much did you really add was it a lot no not much. Okay. no not like nothing. like if it if we don't save it is it a big problem or no it like, no okay. it is not at all <laughs> Because if it was, like, a page worth of typing or something, with you have to retype it, and that's garbage. Then, like, I don't know. Then I would feel bad if it got deleted accidentally, or, like, you if you didn't save it. I'm just pooping. You know how I be. Perfect. That's what kind of what I was looking for. Sideline reporter on the South Florida Temple game just said, shout out to the homeschool people. <laughs> so Why? She said she was homeschooled. That might explain a few things about her. What would that explain? I don't know. I have no clue what that means. Because she went to regular school, too. I'm assuming in order to become a reporter. But shout out to the homies. To the homeschoolies.
I think people still call others homies. Not really. Maybe you're just not in one of those crowds that calls people's homies. What do you call your homies? Bros? Bras? Home skillets. And then I hope that they will provide me with a home skillet. <laughs> they just carry them with, carry it with them. Just... No, no, not immediately. Just in the oh, country. eventually. Okay. Yeah. That's more reasonable than just to expect someone to be carrying a skillet around. That's the way to your heart. Give giving you a home skillet. Yep. Yeah. What you have? You have other ideas? Oh. None that are better than that. No. What's the weakness in this game? Missing tackles. Who and who is this? I don't know. Okay. I just turned it on. Can you believe Tebow plays professional baseball and is an SEC channel person? No. He might not be an SEC channel. He's one of the college football things. Well, believe it, baby. It's true. What's that person's name? Hippity dippity. Have you ever, in your entire life, called someone hun? Not honey, hun. H-U-N. I don't like know. Attila the hun. I would have believed so. I think so, but I'm not positive. Ah, who did you call that? That would have been Emily. Ah. What about Brada? B R A D D A. Brada. No. Ah, you're missing out. Me neither. Or not that I can remember. Oh, I just got a solid knee itch going. There we go. Take care of that bad boy all up in there. We died. Dang, Nabbit. What are you up to, Mang? Uh... 
I'm drafting a review. I'm gonna wait for your your thing, but I was just in the in the right headspace, so I'm, I'm writing some things. About what? Tomb Raider. Oh gosh. Fair enough. Fair enough. Specifically, that trailers are supposed to have the best parts of films in it. And <laughs> I hope this is not the best part. Seeing as though the best part included at least two terrible scenes, got to be concerning for the quality of the film. Plus, there is minimal to no nudity. That is true. Crack, 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 crack. Crack, 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 crack. Just pretended to crack my knuckles. <laughs> Using the architect's codes I'd stolen, Edge sabotaged the Saint Michel Dam, flooding the Comfortress. According to him, it was just desserts for those who only worried about their own comfort. Why did I do what he asked? I could have left the city. Invented myself a new life somewhere else. But I wanted to come back to being public enemy number one. Was it part of who I am? Have we brought justice for the outcasts of Slum 404, or... Have my actions condemned them to more suffering? Only a militant believes that the ends always justify the means. Okay, I'll play. Edge revealed to me that my memory had been tonight. conserved in the fortress of the Bastille uh, since my conviction. Right. I'll go until 45 and and then, so that's 12 minutes. That's fine. The only way to get into the Bastille is with the memories of Johnny Green Teeth. So I'm off. A colorful gone resident of tomorrow, Slum Saturday. The problem and is that Sunday no most I have a tournament really Sunday. Where he hides so I don't know. But I already have the content that has to be posted on Sunday. I already made that. But okay. I will not be able to play tomorrow. Actually maybe Saturday. I can't guarantee okay. it. I'll probably stream on Saturday regardless. Ah What are you gonna play, man? Uh, I kinda liked when you were able to do Clash Royale, but I have a feeling that's a lot of work. Maybe with some of the stuff that I've uninstalled, that'll be easier. Uh, see, that I just, I don't, I usually don't want to play for a six, super significant amount right. of time. Okay, but Nilland. That Tommy can help you get back inside Lab Bastille. Go well, back to his bed. We'll see. This morning when I was there? No. We had to drain Slum 404's lower levels first. You got everything planned out, huh? Laura Croft. Things took a bad turn around here. Have any superpowers or anything? She has a lot of money, but no. 
she does not have any superpowers. She's just a regular old treasure hunter. Aren't we all? It's a little bit like Indiana Bones. Not Jones, Bones. Sure you get the good the good review guy. Yeah. <laughs> 
How goes it, man? Goes okay. Making good progress. Yeah, I got a couple good jokes, I feel. <laughs> That's what it's all about, man. The jokes. That's it. Alright, you want to hear the one about the... The... the sh her ship jumping scene? Do I? Sure. Uh, the second concerning... I need to put concerning. The concerning scene is the ship jump, which defies even more logic. No human being can jump 30 feet in an upward arc like she does often. Like she does. I do not believe she has any superpowers, but the writers seem to imagine her with the power of flight. Or maybe they forgot to add wings during post-production. Alright, that was kind of funny. Zinger. That was better than I thought it was going to be. I expected quite low quality joke there. Because we usually go for the low quality jokes. Oh yeah. But you zinged so hard. So much zinging. You tried to zing zang the fling flang. I'm surprised you don't have an English degree with that. Jax. What about other jokes? This ad. I've heard it before. Uh, that's a good sign, sister. Not, it not means your core memory not resisted today. the treatment. Um. First is the scene where Croft launches a video of her father, Wes, reported on a camcorder screen. Seeing as though she's in the, the secret dungeon of a multi-million dollar company, you would figure they could afford a CD and adapt to plug the camcorder. The video she watches is shot at a strange angle, so you can tell he's harried and under duress while running the recording. This technique does not add anything besides placing the viewer under duress from having to watch the poor GoPro go -pro quality like video <laughs> in a high budget way. Or we believe it to be high budget, but we don't really know. Correct. <laughs> Nothing about it says high budget to me. Or no. from the visual visuals. Are you going to mention that you've seen higher budget in pornos? Let me know when you're ready to call it a night, man. But I know you working hard. Working hard or hardly working. Working hard. You working, they twerking.
right. I have the first draft of it, so I will. I haven't read any of my writing over, but that's the main section. I will read it over tomorrow. Draft or a draft? Draft. Neilan. Nice. I'm waiting for you with um, leaking brain. You send me what you have for Johnny. 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 Format yeah. for that, Johnny and I can adapt it to man, that. Oh uh, yeah. He still remembers all the old passageways beneath right. the steel. At least that's what Edge says. It's bedtime. Okay, I'm in. Bed. I could add those to it. What? To a calendar thing. Calendar. One of the days that we don't have content, I could just plan on writing sure. at least one of these. All right. Well, we are going to sign off now. Do you want to do it? I think I did yeah, it yesterday. Yeah, it's my turn. Well, thank you for joining us, and that's showbiz, baby.